All right, if you have kids in college, you'll get a survey pretty soon. It's all about campus sexual assault. News 12 Connecticut's John Craven says it's a survey that could save lives. Campus rapes are actually way down in Connecticut, but experts think they're severely underreported. A new group hopes to change that. This is the first meeting of the Council on Sexual Misconduct. These 20 people are about to send 200,000 college students Connecticut's first ever statewide survey on campus rape. What do we not know? What do we still need to learn? Where and against whom they've experienced sexual violence, um, whether they've witnessed sexual violence. In Connecticut, campus sexual assaults are down two years in a row, but many victims never even call police sometimes because they were drunk or high. A new law aims to change that. It bans colleges from punishing students or employees for violating the institution's drug or alcohol policy. They might not report because they look at their campus's policy and they think, okay, this is my fault. The new survey will go out by March of 2023. It'll take a hard look at how colleges treat victims. Did you report or file a formal complaint with the institution? How satisfied were you with the institutional response? In Fairfield, Sacred Heart sent out a survey five years ago. Getting students to actually fill it out was a challenge. I don't remember our percentage of students who took it. It wasn't um, particularly high from what I recall. Advocates say this new law is a good start, but they say too many schools throw up too many roadblocks for victims. They say that's why this survey is so important. John Craven, News 12, Connecticut.